Oshkosh Defense announced on October 2 that the U.S. Marine Corps Systems Command has placed a $39.5 million order for additional remotely operated ground unit for expeditionary fires, rogue fires, carriers and associated kits. Based on the Oshkosh Defense Joint Light Tactical Vehicle, JLTV, Rogue Fires is an unmanned aerial vehicle, UGV, that leverages the JLTV's extreme off-road mobility, payload capacity and Oshkosh's advanced autonomous vehicle technologies to support ground-based anti-ship missile, BASM, operations. The unmanned technology associated with Rogue Fires allows the vehicle to operate in teleoperator or leader-follower mode. Oshkosh Defense is committed to providing mission-critical capabilities and innovation to support the U.S. Marine Corps and their modernization plans, said Pat Williams, Chief Programs Officer for Oshkosh Defense. The adaptable design of Rogue Fires leverages next-generation technologies and allows for the integration of scalable weapon system payloads to meet mission requirements. In August 2023, Oshkosh Defense delivered six initial production representative models, PRMS, in support of the Marine Corps' modernization plans of Force Design 2030. Remotely Operated Ground Unit for Expeditionary, Rogue, Fires The Remotely Operated Ground Unit for Expeditionary, Rogue, Fires vehicle system is a missile launcher mounted on an unmanned variant of the Joint Light Tactical Vehicle, JLTV, chassis from Oshkosh Defense. In combination, this technology makes up the USMC's developmental ground-based anti-ship missile, BASM, system, enhancing its capabilities for a competitive edge. The autonomy software on the Rogue Fires vehicle is adapted from a version of the government-owned autonomy stack, RTK, currently in use on GVSC's Expedient Leader Follower, XLF, and Autonomous Ground Resupply, AGR, programs, said Bernie Tyson, GVSC Robotics Division Chief. GVSC's XLF and AGR programs, commonly referred to as Leader Follower, involve a manned lead vehicle that leads a number of unmanned robotic vehicles in convoy to minimize human soldier driving in performing army missions including ground resupply. These programs equip existing military ground vehicles with scalable robotic technology through the integration of modular kits, common interfaces, and a common architecture, Tyson said. While the Marines are using the XLF iteration of GVSC's software for the Rogue Fires program, Tyson said the software will have the ability to be seamlessly updated to GVSC's RTK, which includes additional behaviors developed under the AGR program. RTK is the common autonomy maneuver software across the DoD that enables expedient and affordable integration on current and future ground robotic solutions, Tyson said.